Today marks the last day of the archaeological dig at Wilson's Creek Battlefield. A team of volunteers from the National Park Service and archaeologists from the Midwest Archaeological Center spent two weeks digging on 80 acres, searching for artifacts from the Civil War. They say John and Mary Gwynn owned this property in the 1850s when the 150th Cavalry ambushed them. The team's main goal is finding the Gwynn home in hopes of tracing back troop movements on the battlefield. In historical documents, it's referred to as the Gwynn, Gwynn House. Uh, a woman by the name of Mary Gwynn uh, occupied the, the house at the time of the battle. So finding the house is sort of crucial to the interpretation of this part of the battle. And even though uh, it's thought of as sort of secondary to the main area of the battle, uh, we're finding that uh, there was actually quite a bit of action here. So it is, it, it is truly important. It's truly important that we interpret it in that way. The findings will be sent to Lincoln, Nebraska, where the team will clean and curate them to be displayed at Wilson's Creek National Battlefield.